In Zechariah 8 verse 5, it says this, And the streets of the city shall be full of boys and girls playing in the street. We think about them playing in absolute joy. And yet, often when we become adults, we get too tied up in the stress of our lives. You know, recently, I've had a project where I'm going back to friends and I'm thanking them for what they've done in my life. The biggest thing that I thank them for is when they've given me laughter. It is the ultimate gift. And I pray sometimes I give that to you too. Not just Sunday funnies on Daily Inspiration, but... um, you know, with some of the side comments that are made. I pray that you have laughter in your life, that you give permission to have laughter in your life, no matter what's going on, and that you give that laughter away. Now, children just naturally seem like they know how to express joy the joy of the Spirit of God. They laugh, they play, they sing, and they dance whenever the feeling strikes. As they express their delight, they show everyone how it is to be happy, how it is to be enthusiastic about life. Laughter and play are every bit as important to your sense of well-being as good nutrition and exercise are. And if you've ever been to one of my seminars or on one of our past spiritual retreat cruises, you know that I taught this. That yeah, it's good to work hard, and I believe in working hard, but I believe in playing just as hard. And I've spent a lot of my life playing. And what a rich life it has given me. And it will give you in the future. It is a fountain of joy that you will find resides in you. And the key to open that up becomes laughter and play. It's the first step of letting your own joy come out. But you have to give yourself permission to do this. What an incredible wonder and excitement you will feel when you let joy become, and listen to this, a natural, not created, a natural part of your everyday life. What benefits you will reap when you give yourself permission to laugh, permission to play. Then you'll find that you become more relaxed and you have a heightened awareness of God. I tell you, it will give you a higher recognition of God because you'll be so much in the moment so much in the joy and you will take time to truly enjoy the beauty and the wonder of God's world. I pray for you. I truly do. That the Spirit of God is a wellspring of joy within you. I pray for you that you have laughter that is so good sometimes it's it can't be contained it's a deep soul laughter that just overtakes you and that it overtakes your day and <laughs> you so enjoy yourself oh what greater thing could i do for you as a friend than to wish that for you greater joy, greater laughter, and to 
really live it.